Hi guys and welcome to the next video. In this specific video I'm going to test how Flutter and the development of native apps with Flutter and the language Dart will work on these brand new Apple M1 chips. Uh, just if you're curious, I'm using a 13-inch MacBook Pro baseline with 8GB of RAM and 256GB of SSD storage. As always, I'm going to install or needed tools. And first, I'm searching for Flutter. All right, well, nice little homepage. So I'm going to get started. I'm using macOS. System requirements to install and run Flutter development run must meet these minimum requirements. Yes, yes, tools Flutter depends on these commands and tools being available on your environment. Let's see if it will work. So I'm downloading the Flutter SDK. Oh, Greg, I will catch you when the download is finished. All right, so the download is completed. I will just move this to a specific folder. And there we go, dev. Not created cloud dev and just paste it there. All right, so after removed the SDK, add the Flutter tool to your path, sure. So fire up the terminal. Flutter is working, that was absolutely my fault. Sorry for that. Okay, run Flutter Doctor. Not talk to you. Doctor, so Doctor Summary. Where is it? Ah, it takes quite a while. So Android license status unknown, Cocoa Pods not installed, Flutter plugin not installed. Okay, yeah, sure. A lot of things missing. Okay guys, so what's the next thing I have to do here? Platform iOS setup. Okay. Alright. Alright, make sure it's a license agreement, set up the uh, simulator. So simulator is running. Creating around a simple Flutter app. Okay. I'm just creating it in here. So what is that actually? So I'm not sure if Flutter app. Okay. Flutter create my app. So the app is created, all done. Okay, that's nice. In my app and now hitting Flutter run. All right, so let's see what will happen now. In the best case, I guess the application, yeah, no support is are connected. That's true. Okay, I have to start simulator first and then Flutter run. So let's wait uh, until the simulator is completely fired up. All right, Flutter run again. Okay, it is launching on debug mode on my simulated iPhone 12 Pro Max device. Just a little disclaimer, I never, do, never used Flutter before. So I absolutely have no idea how this thing is actually working. But I guess the demo application is somehow clickable or at least it displays something. So we should see the demo app starting soon. All right, now, here we go. You have pushed the button this many times. And uh, I, we do get a couple of errors. I'm not sure if I'm miss, uh, missing some installation or software, but right now the application is working. I can uh, press uh, the plus button. The counter is uh, counting up, it's increasing its value and seems to be working. I hope guys, uh, this gave you a little idea how Flutter could work on these machines. I'm pretty sure I, I missed some files for installation, but the demo application is working on the simulator. So simulator, Flutter, the combination is working fine right now. So I hope you enjoyed uh, this video guys. I hope you learned something. If you do have any additional questions, just ask them below and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.